Welcome back, everybody. We're gonna recruit another lord. Because my next uh, place I'm going to attack is I'm actually taking care of the first of my um, uh, short campaign objectives, and I'm going to take this area right here. Charlie has Skaven. Upgrade, have insufficient scrap, reinforced weapons. Oh. Oh, that is absolutely cool. Oh, that is actually kind of cool. Yeah, go figure that out. Oh, that is actually so cool. Mm -hmm. I'm going to wait one more time. Karsha. Yeah, that was, that is actually quite cool. Oh, wait, before I piss off Kislev. <laughs> Ed Bot. But yeah, so last time I talked about, um... Why are you coming up towards me, bitch? <coughs> Protoss versus Tal. Um, this week, uh, actually, in two days, the video Whoa. will be, um... Let's get moving. Thing. Will be, um... Orc vs. Starcraft. So, uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, both Protoss vs. Tau and Orc vs. Uh, the entire Starcraft 2 universe... Uh, were both suggestions from the comment section of the the first one being from um, piss the Protoss versus Tau being from Sarah McFarland in the comment section. The second one, the Orc versus Starcraft being from um, Speaking Minds in the comment section. Ooh, you want a non-aggression pack too? Good. I don't want to fight a bunch of fucking people right now. I just want to whip this dude's ass. Now's the time. On it. As I give you up. Hungry, Skull Watcher. Hehehehe. Enemy! Come, Skull Watcher. Talk. Send me to battle. In the motion. Don't think that's going to help you. Man. That ain't gonna help you any. There's a lot of crossbowmen though. I need an answer to this crossbowman. 
And unfortunately, my solution is rather orky. It is Orc Smash. Uh, let me see. Let me go through my comments and see if there's any other good ones that I would like to talk about. Ah, yes, this is a comment that I did not think I would get. This is a comment on the 16th from actually another YouTuber. And uh, this YouTuber is one that I very so much enjoy their videos. Um, actually, for this video, and I'm going to write this down now before I forget. Um, I will put a link to his channel in the description. He's actually a really cool dude. Um, I have talked to him in private. Okay, there we are. Uh, That's what I was trying to do. It does not look like they are moving. Damn crossbowmen. Just going ahead a little bit too much. Yeah, those crossbowmen are starting to hurt. I do like how they have tried to stop me. Fuckers actually did some one it. Thank you. 
that was that was nice. But anyway, so uh, the comment. I took a bigger beating than I was hoping I would. But at least I didn't have to do a siege. Um, so he commented on my Raven's Blood video in my uh, Soulstorm playthrough. And it was Mr. Get Good Fox. So for those of you who, uh, who don't know, for most of my life I have hated everything horror. Especially zombies. Well, uh, one of my friends, uh, Kibbs from the Bickering Bunch, got me into a game called State of Decay 2. So I'm playing it, so I decided, eh, fuck it, I'll give it a try. I actually really like the game. But I didn't really know how to play it. So I got introduced to Get Good Fucks through his tutorials on, um, Fifth Skills. And then just fell in love with his videos. And now I'm actually... Uh, he just completed his Warlord Lethal Zone playthrough. And he's in the process of doing a Dead Island playthrough. Which I actually got Dead Island uh, from watching him play it. I have played it before because a friend owned it. But... I never owned it myself, so I got the Dead Island Definitive Edition, and now I'm playing through that as Sam, the big dude from New Orleans, and um, and he is the blunt weapon master, and oh, it is so much fun playing as him. So, give his channel a look. He's actually a really cool guy. He does really amazing videos. I wish I was half as good as he is, honestly. Um, he, uh, he puts out some amazing quality videos. He really does. So, like I said, check him out. He is, uh, he's really, really awesome. Now, if I could just get the fucking screen to load. Let's see, what other comments come to mind of importance? Ah. Um... Talked about that. Uh, got a guy, James Pagwip, uh, for my Warcraft 2 playthrough, saying uh, that that video deserves more views because he loves Warcraft. I appreciate that. I really do. Um, I, I have played Warcraft for an interesting amount of time. Let me... I was about four. So, looking at like 26 years, maybe. I have to look this one up. Facebook. Uh, there we are. So I put this up, up in a new tab. Warcraft one came out in 1994. So yeah, that came out when I was three. I think I played it first time when I was four. So why? Oh, good. My computer is um, my computer is not liking this. Um. <laughs> uh, and so it's uh, it's one of those things where I played for the better part of 26 years so yeah uh, another one uh, that I found really important is for my alternate heresy uh, Helldrake which has been putting a lot of comments and I appreciate them um, in the uh, on all, especially a lot of my like Starcraft versus uh, 40k videos um I have a sediment upgrade he um he's put a lot of information up there so that is okay so I, I really appreciate the uh not I don't want to say back and forth because it's not really what it is but the um but the interaction 
But he did put one comment that I do want to address. Honestly, I don't. Uh, this is for my alternate heresy videos. Honestly, I do, do not see Vulcan. Fuck you. Uh, falling to chaos at all. He is simply too nice of a person. Should an alt heresy happen, I think Vulcan will be a third party because of seeing what the chaos is. Like, <laughs> unfortunately, like most of, uh, no offense intended at all to Hell Drake, but, um,. Faction destroyed us to mark, which should mean yes. Um, I am true power. so normally I would tend to agree that Vulcan could not canonic canonically fall to chaos. However, this is not canon. This is literally what would happen if all none of the loyalists become traitors and all none of the traitors stay loyal. So, you know, I, I get what you're saying that canonically he wouldn't, but at the same time, this isn't supposed to be canonical. Was Kislev a lot weaker than me? Did I see that right? Holy crap, they are a lot weaker than me. Um I oh yeah. let's start taking them on. I am gonna wait a couple turns though. I'll do actually is since I'm already close to 20 minutes here I'll end this episode here do all my recruiting and then start the next episode after all the recruiting so yay thank you all for watching the video if you enjoyed it or want to check out some of my other content check out some of my other videos or playlists on the channel if you would like to support the channel you can always join Patreon or just, you know, throw out a comment. Let me know what I can do to improve. You know, uh, join the Discord. You can throw your suggestions there as well. But most importantly, I hope you all have a very, very wonderful day. I hope if you're going through something, it gets a lot better for you. I hope everyone finds that kind of good luck push they're looking for. And with all that being said... I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye!